Welcome to any TV per reviews. Today's review is a line from Black Note that I never actually reviewed. Black Note have once contacted me to review the V line. I can't remember what it was, but I didn't have the time, so I said, you know, I'll let you know in a later date, but I never did. So when one of the subscribers has asked me to review the V line, I said, you know what, that's a good opportunity for me to review the V-Line uh, from Black Note. Now, Black Note has been my first naturally extracted tobacco, the original, the main line from Black Note. This is the Sonata. You got the pre uh, Prelude, you got the Forte, you've got the Sonata, you've got the Legato, you got the Quartet, and you got the Solo. Besides the Solo, um, the Solo I didn't vape much because it's a mental. All of these were my staple vape from the beginning. Well, nearly from the beginning when I discovered naturally extracted. So um, Black Note does have a very special place in my vaping uh, success that I managed to get off the cigarettes over two years now. So I am very much looking forward to review the V-Line. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and re review four liquids of the V-Line and either I'll manage to get two and then I'll do, a, uh, I'll do a pause and re-wick and do it again, but I'll try to get it all in one review. So like this, if someone wants to review the V-Line, they'll have it all in one review. So the first one we'll review um, is the, where was it, the Jazz. Now I put below, um, what is the difference really between the main line this one here to the V line. A very interesting how Black Note have uh, described it. To simply explain the difference between the main Black Note NET range to the V line range of liquids could be compared to your favorite commercial beer or house wine or blended coffee. That is the V line. Whilst the Black Note main line classic collection could be compared to a special craft beer or fine wine or single origin coffee. In other words, the main line is a single variety leaf, um, called, uh, well, extracted and, and prepared and meticulously done as Black Note. You all know how Black Note are, uh, I think, um, cutting edge in how they produce their liquids. It takes them years to produce. But the same method goes on the V-range, v because on all of them, you'll see below in the description, two, three year, two to three years creation process. So we have to treat it with the utmost respect, because these liquids are supreme. Price-wise, they are expensive. Yes, uh, you only get them in 10 mil, or in, uh, in other websites in the US, you can get them in 30 mil, but they are expensive compared to many other naturally extracted tobacco that I reviewed more UK based. So um, yeah, we have to treat this with, with um, a bit of respect because these are supreme liquids. So after we said all that to give uh, a few words on, on what we're reviewing today, we'll go straight to the jazz. And the jazz is American blend, smooth and fruity. A cigarette or pipe-like vaping experience. Naturally extracted from several American tobacco varieties, two, three years creation process. Uh, and also in the end it says, aged and fermented in, a wine, in wine oak barrels. So I'm expecting some kind of um, fruity note here and a oaky type of note in the background, I assume. Another thing that I would like to bring to your attention is that the original comes in 3, 6, 12, um, 18. So when I wanted a 9, I had to buy the 6 and add 72 milligram or take a 6 and a 12 and mix to get a 9. But on the V line, you get also an option of 9 milligram. Perfect for me. So some of them I've got it on 9 and some of them I've got on a 3 or 6. I just added the nicotine to get them all 9. Right. Um, 
So, we'll give jazz a go on my uh, Geek Vape Emmet Mouse to Long RDA. Um, yeah, that will be the first one. The second one, I think I'm gonna put it in my Fev because I've got my Fev all wicked up and ready to go. So, we'll see how we go. Right. Okay, get the airflow all open and we'll give the jazz a go from the V-line of Black Knot. Oh, yes, you can taste straight away the smoothness of the tobacco liquid. Wow. This is a... Uh, just one second, the O-ring just sticking out. This is a smooth, you can taste the nuttiness, the earthiness, the very delicate of a classic naturally extracted. What you get is here is like a fruity note along the vape. I can't tell you what type of fruit, but it's a delicious fruity note. Within the tobacco, you're tasting a bit of that oaky flavor. I think it because it was um, aged and formatted in, in wine oak barrels. It's no wine flavor, but you can taste that oaky note to it. Very nice. And the tobacco itself, it's so smooth, so mellow. Um, it's, it's a delight. What well, is a black note? I mean, if you ever vape black note, there is that um, underlying quality that you know how much black note have invested in getting the the liquids perfect, and you can taste it straight away. That was also reflecting the price of this liquid. See, Drake's have got the tobacco fusion with added fruit notes. You can watch those uh, reviews on my channel. This is a similar concept, but the difference is that you've got here like a sort of not single fruit. It's sort of more of a fruity note. And I can't pinpoint what type of fruit, but is a similar profile to, to the Drake's tobacco fusion. Um, yeah, very similar, but different. This is a, you got a black note signature here. And that is very hard to imitate. Um, it's the underlying supreme quality of the liquid. Very nice. I can't say what fruit. It's like, um, um, I, I, can't, I can't say. But the first thing that pops into my mind is like a, Maybe a bit of a mango or pineapple, or some kind of type of. See, it can't pinpoint the fruit. Well, it is smooth and fruity. That's what it is. And how to describe it? It's a several American tobacco varieties. Um, and you get this uh, oaky note in it and this tobacco itself is absolutely smooth and mellow with a very nice fruity note that runs along this whole profile. Very nice. Yep, this is an all day vape. I suspect all of them will be an all day vape. But this is sort of a not in your face tobacco. If you like a tobacco with an added fruity note, this is delicious. Um, the jazz gives you the tobacco you crave, the flavor, and with a very lovely oaky note, but it gives you also that little fruity note that takes away the edge of being pure tobacco. So we'll put this aside. Now the next one might take me a minute or two to set up, right? This is my Fev. Uh, if I'll put a link above, like this, you can watch the review on this Mouse to Long RTA, the flashy Vapor version 4.5 S Plus, big name. 
um, but the flavor is divine here. So I wanted to try the next one that I want to review. This is the English blend that's called Pop. So one of the subscribers have told me that he's got a bit of flooding from the Fev. So I told, I described him how to wick it. So I decided to just show in case he watches this review, how I wick the Fev. You see, it's much longer and it's folded nearly like an RDA. So whenever any excess liquid comes down to the deck from the juice flow, yeah, from these juice flow holes in the top, so they hit the coil, they hit the coil and the wick, but any excess that goes down, this mass of wick that is covering the whole front of the deck will pick it up no problem at all and you won't have no flooding. Okay, so let's go now to the pop. A uh, bit difficult to open these case, these boxes. These come in a sleeve, but these come in boxes. Um, very nice designed, very nice. And this came as a nine milligram, as you can see. So this was perfect. I didn't have to add or do anything to it. Just the ones I wanted the nine, they didn't have them in stock. Um, these all child protection type of caps. And what I'm going to do is I'll, I'll moisten the wick on on my uh, coil master and then I will put it on my side by side um, mod. But give this quite a lot of liquid because I want to straight away review it. I don't have to wait till actually the juice flow gets into action. That actually is a very, very effective juice flow. Um, this is a top tank, I must say. Right, I think I moistened this enough. Let me just make sure. I don't want to overdo it. Hmm. Like all natural extracted tobacco, it's got that earthy, nutty smell, but any added flavoring I would taste when I vape. Um, right, we'll put on the cap. And now we'll go about filling up the tank. Now, I don't want to overfill it. It's the first time I'm tasting it, so we'll give it a bit just to give it a, a start. And if I like it, I'm sure I would, I would just add, and it's obviously it's bottom fill just screw this back make sure all is secure i'll take it off and i'll put it now on my side by side and we'll review this liquid on my fev this is the mix by aspire right this is a 0 0.9 ohm coil I've done it myself, round wire, si uh, seven wraps of 26 gauge. Okay, so now let's describe this liquid, the pop. English blend, rich and relaxing. Um, cigarette, RYO, or pipe-like vaping experience, naturally extracted from several tobacco varieties, two, three year creation process. Tobacco essence extracted through a cold microwave. Okay, fully aromatic experience, reminiscent of a pipe tobacco. So let's give this a go. Oh, wow. Very nice. Very nice. Mmm. This is a classic. Uh, this is a bit more robust than the, the one we reviewed, the jazz. Um, you've got this rich flavor of the tobacco itself and it's got a, another spice in the background. I wouldn't say a fruity note, but a bit of a floral. Wow, this is good. 
this is good. I'm, I'm happy I'm reviewing this now because I think I'm going to buy some more. It's a, it's a shame that they only sell it in 10 mil. This is a, a more of a robust tobacco. Um, you can taste like a added spice to it, like a, a floral note, not a fruity note. Um, there's no sweetness to it as such, but it is not dry, you know? It is like um, more of a pipe tobacco, but perfectly old tobacco vape for smokers of cigarettes as well. It's a very nice flavor to it. Mm. See, the tobacco itself is a bit of a nutty, earthy, piney, like nearly a piney uh, taste to it. And you got this spice that's rolling along. I can't tell you what type, but this is like a floral, like a bit of a pipe tobacco in it, like a pipe, yeah. It's not like the English mixture, for instance, that I reviewed from La Tabacaria. The English mixture of La Tabacaria is a smoky, full-bodied uh, pipe tobacco. This is, is a very much um, like the old black notes. They're never over bold, except for, La, for the Quartet. That is the boldest, smokiest liquid they've got. But this is bolder than the jazz but i wouldn't call this a very bold tobacco this is a mild all day vape uh with a delicious tobacco flavor with that spice in the background like a floral note to it you hear how silent the airflow on this one is it's a it's a perfect tank hmm. very happy with it and it wicks like a dream i mean you see, I'm vaping it now all the time. No burnt flavor. It just picks it up straight away. Now I'm getting a bit more of a sweet note to it. It's like um, sweetish, but not very sweet, like a perfect sweetness with like a floral note with the more bolder tobacco. Very nice. I would like to describe it longer, but I don't want this review to take too long. So we've got four liquids to go. But in essence, this is a all day, a bit bolder, a bit drier than the than the jazz, than the which, which one the jazz. Um, but it's got that floral note to it that is absolutely delicious. Mm. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Yep, this is the pop English blend, rich and relaxing. Yes, I might even put it in my e-pipe, but for now I'm gonna vape this on the fev. Um, the flavors are coming from this fev, perfect. It's, a, it's what they say, a fully aromatic experience, re reminiscence of a pipe tobacco is spot on. It's aromatic, it is a bit nutty, earthy, like a piney, and this floral note is absolutely divine. I can't pinpoint that flavor, but it is perfect. Yeah, I'm gonna fill up this tank soon with this liquid, although this is a 10 mil and it's already going down, but this is delicious, the pop. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to put you on pause, re-wick my uh, Amit mouse to long RDA, and we'll carry on reviewing the other two. Right, so we're back and re-wicked, cleaned everything, and ready to to review the third one, and this is called House. Um, I'm not sure how house get into it because we had jazz, pop, house, and then we've got the last one, the rock. So, sort of all musical um, reference, but house, maybe, not sure. The house is oriental blend, pleasant and light. Um, R Y O P 
po a pipe or cigarette-like vaping experience, naturally extracted from several oriental tobacco varieties, uh, created from classic small leaves of oriental tobacco, two, three years creation process, song cured, uh, and again it goes through the cold extraction process. The cold extraction normally what means that the end result is a bit of a milder tobacco. Heat extraction normally is a much bolder, it retains its full bodiness, so black note are normally a mild liquid. Can't smell much, um, only by vaping black note you really can tell, except for the quartet, as I said before, is the only one that's got a real smoky um, flavor to it. It's actually absolutely divine, first thing in the morning with a coffee, wow. Yeah, you can smell the delicate earthiness of the tobacco. So, let's give this a go. Right, so let's give House a try. Mm. <clears throat> I'm so happy I'm reviewing these now because I never reviewed the V-Line. For some reason, I never did. There's always... A yeah, but at least we're doing it now. Well, this is a delicious, spicier tobacco. Mm, it's got a bit of sweetness to it. Uh, this is a smooth, like all of them. But this is a bit of a, a, a very mild, and you've got this spice, this oriental spice that goes around the, the whole flavor that is very good indeed I can't pinpoint this flavor but it's so pleasant to the palate so you what you're tasting is the tobacco the nuttiness the mild earthiness of the tobacco when I say mild earthy and nutty it's not nuts uh, it is a earthy like a, like a, when you eat nuts, you know, from the peel, like, a, I don't know what kind of nuts, but it's, it's, it's to describe a note. You know, when you drink wine, sometimes they tell you, even cigars, you get a chocolate, plum, um, nutty, uh, leathery, um, you know, all these type of notes. It's not actual flavors. It's a note where your mind associates with over time your palate gets more used to detecting these notes and you sort of describe them in your way the same here this is a oriental it's like a, a oriental spice to it hmm. very nice it leaves a very nice flavor in your mouth like a bit of a sweet flavor and you're getting the, 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 the delicate, light taste of the tobacco and this lovely background flavor. Oh yeah, this is very good indeed. Very good indeed. This is like, um, see, none of them are in-your-face tobacco. Um, they're all light and mellow with added sort of background notes to it. So this is a classic of an all-day vape for all those who don't like very bold, smoky, peaty tobaccos, heavy latikias and, and perique. This is so light and, and airy. Um, it's very, very good. This is delicious um, liquid, I must tell you, the house, um, delicious. I mean, they're all good. The jazz and the pop that I reviewed just now, delicious, all of them. Every one of them has got different. This is the beauty of naturally extracted. When you smoke, you smoke one brand, yeah? I used to smoke Marlboro Lights. And that's it, you got the cigarette flavor. Here you're getting so many different varieties and flavors that is, makes vaping such a pleasure.
this is as they describe it pleasant and light and you've got this sweet sweetish note to it like a oriental I can't describe it more because this is a flavor that you need to vape to understand what I mean it's like a very nice pleasant flavor that is actually very nice and you, you taste it, it's delicious very nice Mm, this is this is top. I mean, they're all favorite. They're all nice. The jazz is just a bit more fruity. Uh, if you don't like a fruity note in your vape, the pop and the house so far are superb. The pop is more of a, you get that the aromatic. Okay, I just said what all about the pop, but this house is absolutely divine. Oh yeah, I can vape this all day long, no problem at all. Delicious. That flavor in the background just keeps you want to vape it more and more. It's, it's absolutely it's superb. Yeah, the house, the oriental blend, pleasant and light, delicious with that flavor in the background that is gives you that. Um, oriental spice that is absolutely delicious right we'll put this aside I've got another piece of wick I'm gonna now re-wick and review the last one and this is the rock the Italian blend okay so give me one second right so I've got it all freshly wicked cleaned out and ready to review the last one of this V line from black note and this is the rock Italian blend strong and complex um, cigarette or pipe vaping uh, like experience you can see them all in the description uh, naturally extracted from several Kentucky tobacco varieties two three years creation process tobacco essence extracted through cold maceration process yeah fire cured Kentucky tobacco naturally extracted we don't need proof from black note that's 100% naturally extracted if you ever go on website of black note it's one of the most sophisticated but uh, transparent um, the way they do it all they've got the whole scientific data how this done it's amazing so let's taste this one this is most probably the strongest blend from the from the varieties again you can't smell much maybe i'll smell it when i uh, saturate the wick i'm quite happy it, um, it's delicious flavors yeah again the classic smell of a naturally extracted the fresh tobacco flavor of the fresh leaf it's like you open a packet of fresh cigarettes. Yeah, delish. Okay, let's give the rock a go. Yeah. This is a more full body tobacco, but still not overly bold as all black notes are this is the purest tobacco from the lot this is pure naturally extracted tobacco without any add-ons not oriental that f delicious flavor that would just review the house not that the the English blend with that beautiful spice also in the background and the jazz the fruity note this is squarely tobacco divine flavor it's a oaky piney earthy knotty not too bold a bit of sweetness to it
Mm, very nice indeed. Mm. Yeah, I'm a bit surprised. Well, I've got so many varieties of naturally extracted. We're blessed with a, such a huge variety from all the vendors that I reviewed. So, but I'm so pleased that I, um, I'm reviewing them now. This is a top line. It's a bit cheaper than the original. I think two pounds cheaper, I think, per liquid. A one pound fifty. You can put it on Google and search, put in black note V line range. But still it's a bit exp more expensive than what you can get in other UK based naturally extracted juice cabin, basic liquid, Drake's. There you get them fifty mils, here you get them in ten mils. But uh, nevertheless, it's superb. This is a straight up delicious classic example of what naturally extracted should be. It's perfectly mild, no, I wouldn't say mild, perfectly smooth, that's the word. Perfectly smooth, rounded, a bit more full body than the rest, but still not bold, all day vape. Very nice indeed. The how the rock. This is very nice. They're all very nice. I can't tell you which one is favorite. They're all favorite. I love them all. Each one is different, and each one is delicious in its own right. So they're all favorites. If I have to buy, I'll buy them all. This is a delicious all day tobacco vape with a bit of oakiness to it and a bit of like a pine flavor, a bit sweet, nutty, earthy, delicious tobacco. When you've got such top liquids, the range that I just review, why would one want to smoke? I, I fully recommend for any smoker to pick up the Black Note V-Line and the original line, but to start off with the V line, this is more of a added notes to them that make it so good. This one is more of a straightforward tobacco that a lot of smokers will appreciate. It will replace the cigarette in a perfect manner, like all Black Note range, really, and all naturally extracted tobacco I reviewed. So you've got a huge amount of choice. But to narrow it down, the V-Line is perfect for a new smoker because you've got that so mild and mellow. Um, yeah, Sometimes vaping causes smokers to cough. It's a different type of sensation when you vape. But these will give you the compensation of the mellowness of it, the smoothness of it, so you wouldn't cough. Uh, even for someone who just picked up vaping today, these are perfect for him. Perfect. What I recommend is to buy the whole V-Line. If you like a mental, you can choose also the mental one. I am not crazy on mental. On occasion, I do vape mental. The Solo is very good as a mental, but I'm sure the V-Line mental is also very good. Um, but as these four that I review today goes, these are perfect naturally extracted tobaccos for seasoned vapors who like naturally extracted and for new vapors who would like to start to get off the cigarettes and to get something that is very as close as possible in vaping form you can't go wrong with any of those the only one that i can say the jazz has got a bit of fruity note so those who like pure tobacco um, the jazz got a bit of a fruity note to it the pop house and rock are all tobacco with a very nice spice to it the pop as i said before it's got that very delicious spice and the oriental has got the house and the rock this one here is more of a pure tobacco but still you're getting all this delicate uh, variety of tobacco flavors notes in your vape 
absolutely delicious. Okay. I think I will finish this review on the four e-liquids that I reviewed today. The V-Line from Black Note. And let me just get them all in line so I can show it to you all in one go. Yep. Rock, house, pop and jazz. All are divine, delicious. Everyone has got his own flavor profile you can read below how I, how they describe it and you can listen to this review how i describe it more or less the same as they describe it and you know you're getting top quality top quality of naturally extracted tobacco 95 percent healthier than cigarettes and a lot tastier that i can tell you for sure i have no desire to smoke at all how could you if you got this type of liquids available or any other naturally extracted that i review that you can watch my review and decide on the merit of that review as the v-line goes i'm very pleased to review it as they all are excellent excellent naturally extracted tobaccos each with his own profile delicious looking forward to fill up my other tanks and enjoy them definitely order some more okay i hope this review is beneficial uh, thank you for watching until the next review take care enjoy your vape bye bye for now